All right, and we are live with the Evil Within. This is the fourth live stream that we are doing. Uh, this is going to be a good time. I've been overwhelmingly been enjoying my my playthrough this game. Uh, we've had a, some minor hiccups with like some of the boss battles, some of the insta death stuff, some of the checkpoints. But overall, incredibly enjoying my time with this. Um, do I have any more keys? No, I do not. Apparently, last time when we signed off, I deemed it not necessary to um, upgrade myself. But let's go ahead and double check that before we actually uh, get into it. Life, sir. Nope. Okay, maybe I was smart before I logged off. I just didn't need anything. Um, stock, that's maxed out. Someone was telling me to max out the harpoon bolts, because then, then you get uh, fire damage, which is an insta-kill on regular enemies. But... Oh. Explosive bolts, I don't trust them. Dock bolts are okay. Um, a lot of this stuff is just kind of like, okay, I guess. But... Um... We can upgrade some of this stuff, I guess. Actually, just the one. So I do want to basically just put all my power into my guns. Need to go over here, I think. Oh, gotta examine this, apparently. Rubik must be really pissed now. Breaking a stem terminal? Never thought he'd go that far. Wait, stem? Oh, he must be close if he's severing ties with the past. All he has left is his connection to the present. The full stem in the hospital. Hospital? Beacon Mental Hospital? And that's where he'll be. Waiting for him. If somebody doesn't get there first, there'll be no way out for anyone. I genuinely don't know who that's supposed to be. I have an odor of blood about you. I am very confused about that, uh, to be honest. Let's go ahead and shoot up. And, oh, there we go. Now we can go. Okay, and inventory check. Reload our gun. Sniper. Oh, yeah. Grenade. We have flashes and harpoons. Okay. Not great for boss battles, but it's something. And the sniper is basically useless in close range encounters. It's uh it's kind of ridiculous. You know what? Let's see if I can upgrade my stock of that real quick. That way I can get an extra bolt and that's an extra free kill. With well, the way I've been upgrading the flash bolts, um might be incredibly useful. The worrying type, I see. Yes, indeed. Alright, so let's go to stock. Agony. Nope. I'm just shy. Maybe I should have spent, uh, save my points. Oh well. That's fine. I believe we're going to be running into a boss battle with this thing right now. As much as I don't want to, because this thing's fucking freaky as shit. And good ammo. Matches. I can make so many resources with this thing, and I just haven't. 
been spending it on more important stuff apparently. Well, at least it's deciding not to camp there. That's convenient for me. Alright, jump up. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> uh, that's a good tease with the green gel right there. That was fucked up. That was unnecessarily mean. Right. It was just through here. Not gonna ammo. One way. Thank you for the sign. Has a. Oh shit. God damn it. You should run, dude. That was sad. You should have ran way sooner. Alright. Just got some shots in. Oh. Oh. Some ammo or whatever's in here. Oh, god damn it. Red barrels. Damn, that was not even close. I am doing god awful right now. I am. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna die. Alright. <laughs> what kind of fucking ragdoll nonsense was that? Okay, so I gotta not stop for resources. Shit. Just constantly stay on the move. Out. Get in that room. That flash isn't gonna do me shit in here. Oh, damn it. I should heal up. Shit. Sniper. One. Two. Three. Four. Oh shit. Fucking flipping cars. Oh shit. Nope. Do not eat me. There we go. There's a very disturbing death animation if it manages to eat you like that. It's a very... It falls within the definition of vor, I, I guess. If you don't know what that is, please do not investigate it. Well, that seemed a little bit easier than I remember, but I was just kind of shooting at it like a jackass. No real strategy aside from run and shoot. Alright. Let's go back and scavenge for resources. Oh. All full on health. Keeps giving me flash ammo, but like I know like I can stun the boss or whatever, but doesn't seem like it'd be doing too much in the face of uh, something directly in front of me like that. Like for me, the utility mostly comes from um, 
comes from flashing like regular enemies, and that way you can get like an insta kill, um, like sneak hit on them. Just doing for as what the name implies, just flashing doesn't seem as useful as that, so. Hence the reason for not using it. But we somehow managed to survive that, so I'm happy. And let's just forget how I just absolutely got wrecked on that first attempt. That was pretty sad on my part. Just couldn't keep my distance and just kept smacking me around. Alright, next chapter. Elevator is magically changed lighting for whatever reason. Totally different color. And apparently continuing to do so. And we are back in the city, apparently. We were in a subway. Kind of. Not subway, we were like in a parking garage complex area. No, no, none of the geography in this game is supposed to make sense. It's kind of the point, but it's still funny to laugh at. Right. Back in the city. Albeit with a lot of water. All sucking now. City's just so fucked up. It literally looks like the end of uh, Sonic Adventure 1 where you're fighting like chaos. The the only building left untouched. How can that be? Because it's magic. Is there any collectibles around here? Can I get on this? No. Get up. Wait, does that say Tango up there? That, that's because uh, the, the developer's name is Tango Gameworks. Does that literally say Tango Design? Final white shirt. <laughs> Black hair curse. Oh, ha ha ha. Very on the nose. Nothing about this place makes sense. Oh, shit. Oh yeah, I should be using my crossbow. Something in there. <laughs> oh, found a magnum. That's gonna be doing a lot of freaking damage. Oh, map fragments. Uh, one minor complaint. I could be totally wrong. I'd have to go back and look at it. I don't believe they just straight up tell you, like, the, the breakdown of the stats uh, for each weapon. They just show you, like, what each next step, like, how, like, what percentile increase that would be or whatever. Um, let's see. Magnum we are going to want to save for bosses, as is in typical Resident Evil tradition. Is that Leslie? Oh 
Oh shit. We're gonna get squeezed. Don't wanna be squeezed. God, that would be such a fucking god awful way to go out. Like, if that were to happen to me, I would just totally be thinking of that scene from, uh, from Akira, the, the movie, not the manga. It's where the, what's her name, Kaiori gets fucking squished in between uh, Tetsuo's fucking expanding body. It's pretty nasty. I got a lot of gel now, though. The game won't say actually give me an opportunity to uh, spend it. Oh, but we have an enemy. So let's. There we go. Ammo on you. There we go. Let's just get a lot of these guys out of the way right now. Oh! <laughs> uh, I should have fucking known that. That I wouldn't pass through the gate. Come on. Walking so slow. Alright, there's some boxes over there that I won't open yet. Because... There's a lot of enemies around. I don't want to be sneaky. Probably gonna be a shit sneaking attempt. Yep. Whatever. Let's just smack these open. to go up there I think. Hey buddy. Oh I guess I can crawl through here. Oh fuck off. There we go. Get those insta kills in. Nothing? You're not gonna drop shit? Freaking rude. There we go. He dropped something because he's considerate and not a jackass. How much shotgun ammo? How much shotgun ammo can I carry? Eight. Okay, so I'm still good. Am I supposed to go though? In the gates to go that way. I genuinely do not remember. Huh. Oh, there's a fucking door over there. Yeah, that might be the answer, cheese. <laughs> Duh. It is locked. All right. Um. Oh, there we go. Got the big rebar dude too. Oh shit. Nope. Okay, so I have enough to basically get two enemies. Enough, uh, stun time on the bolt. No more ammo for the crossbow. You have a weapon on you, buddy.
go got the key oh another one oh shit um do you know what I have a grenade let's toss that oh shit Fucking machine gun people are there right here. Damn it. This is aggravating. Alright, so they're all down. Where is they? Great. Okay. Okay. Come on, I need to. And yeah, of course there's more spawning behind me. Why do zombies always get unlimited fucking ammo too? Declaring bullshit on that. How did that miss? That was like fully on the body. There we go. Fuck off already. <laughs> That was mildly annoying. Uh, let's see, grenade. What? That didn't, that didn't even leave a scratch on him. Out of ammo. There we go. Guess you guys are just gonna keep spawning. Probably get moving before I just constantly have to waste shit on you guys. Let's see if this. Yep, this guy has resources. Right. I know we have to jump, go down, but let's see if there's anything up here. Yep, just a little ammo. Like a ringing going on. Don't know what that's about. Okay, never mind. I was gonna stealth kill that dude, but I guess that's not happening. Because we gotta swim now. And I have not gone swimming in freaking forever. It is a tiring ass exercise if you're out of shape. Alright, so we can't go in the water without this thing eating us, so we need to give it something else to eat that is not us. Don't eat me. Eat that. Let's go up here. Anything else to shoot? Oh, no, 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 no. Do not jump straight towards it, Sebastian. No. That was an a that was an awful idea, dude. Run, <laughs> get out of there. 
Holy shit. Here, hit the body with that. There we go. Go, go, go. Oh no. Don't come for me. Don't eat me. Nope. Oh, that gives me fucking anxiety like a motherfucker. Sure as hell don't want to go back in the water anytime soon. Nope. Here's some gel. Yeah. Begging for attention right now. Need more boxes. You know what? There's gonna be a lot of fighting right here if I remember correctly, so we are going to heal up while we can. Now we're all drugged out. Oh, you know what? Now I remember what enemies we're going to be fighting. It's going to be these fucking Ruvik lookalikes with a fucking cloak or whatever. But uh, you have to burn them in order to kill them, if I remember correctly. Otherwise, they just kind of keep getting back up. I don't trust you. Yep, you are alive. There's Ruvik, and there's a Ruvik double. Oh shit! Don't enjoy that. There we go. Burn him. Yep, and if you kill the clone, that kills everyone else in the arena, too. Some kind of fake? Yep. Here, let's get a, some backup bolts going for, um... I really like the flash ones. We're gonna stick with some of those. Back in the hospital. This place yeah, is filthy. That'd be the first time we're not using a traditional means of reflection. We're using some uh, is this weird doing? light or whatever. Is that good? Are you all right? You do realize there would be no one to replace me. Yeah, this place is getting all kinds of fucked up now. But we are nearing the end of the game, so that's okay. Alright. Let's see, weapons. Critical. Yeah, let's get our let's make this fucking pistol a fucking murder machine, hell yeah. Fuck everything else. Uh, let's see. Flash. That's fine as is. We should really get our sprint up though. Alright, and then let's save. Gotta go all the way down, because we've been using rolling saves, which, hey, if you're playing any kind of game and it gives you the option to do rolling saves, I highly recommend, like, without a freaking shadow of a doubt, always, always use rolling saves, even if it becomes a little bit of a hassle having to, like, save over older stuff, because you only have, like, a limited amount that you can use. 
always use rolling saves. It will save your ass if something goes wrong. Because the alternative is much more frustrating than any amount of like minor inconvenience. It might be like in the slightest. Alright, we gotta get over there. There's a bunch of freaking enemies. Oh shit. That was a wasted shot. Alright, so a bunch of enemies are gonna rush over here. And we're gonna have to try to take them out. Where are you going? There we go. Got one. Is no one coming? Oh shit. Guess you did. Oh shit, they're waiting right there. Um shotgun ammo. I got shotgun ammo. There we go, burn him. Oh shit, High explosives. Burn. Always easier to go up to people when they're burning. For <laughs> you got smacked again, holy shit. If you uh, come up from their uh, legs versus their front, because that way they can smack you around. <laughs> oh, that's so comically fucked up. Oh shit. Um. Grenade. Toss. Damn, we got most of them. There we go. Oh shit. Really? There we go. Come on, two more of you, right? Let's do this. No one's gonna open the door? Oh, see, there's stuff beyond the door. They just don't want to come out anymore. I'll just come up. I don't care. Oh, now they went down. Are they gonna pop up now? Yep. Oh shit. There we go. That's one. Where's the. There you go. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. Come on. Damn it. Come on, I know you're gonna pop up. There we go. Pistol and that's. See, so I. Oh no, I guess that is as far as I could have gone over there. That does not open from this side. Got some crafting materials. Syringe. What did I even grab? I don't even know. Matches. 
something to turn? Oh shit, my camera turned off. I forgot to do the one thing I'm supposed to do every time I use my camera. It's like shutter doesn't shut. Focus should still be yeah. uh, just a little bit. There we go. Now we're good. Shit, more fucking machine. I do not like these machine gun dudes. Okay, um. Now I'm gonna say let's craft some shit because I'm running low on ammo. Um. Okay. Oh shit. Okay. Get away from me. You're gonna blow. God, you got a freaking mask of steel or something. Come on, burn. Damn it. Shit. I can't do anything if you guys all bum rush me. This is so fucked up. There we go. That should work. Anyone still up here? No. Where'd that other- Oh, you're still over here. Oh, really? You're, you're freaking locked on me the second I pop out? Yeah, I don't trust that. There we go. Let's go up here. Yeah, these freaking machine gun enemies are no joke. It's, it's it's not even fair. It's like the second they see you, it's just instant hit. Uh, usually in these types of games, they give you like a couple seconds. Like as they prime their weapon, they get ready to shoot. Nope. These guys are fucking uh, like special forces or something. Can I not just... No. I have to pull this first. At least I got ammo and shit. How am I not hitting that? I freaking shot it like a million times. <laughs> Out of shit. Ammo. Yeah, I got a heal. Come on, dude. Reload faster. One. Shit. Damn it. Come on, don't... I, okay, now I'm just getting stun locked. That... That is stupid. I can't stand fucking stun locks in games. That is... Actively annoying me. That's even worse than the insta-kills, because, you know, at least they get you, like, okay, yeah, I'm dead, whatever, but this is just, like, anytime you think you have, like, the fucking sliver of hope, it's just like, yeah, no, you're just dead. So, that shit sucks. Not a fan of that, in the slightest. Here, let's just get you out of the way. There we go. Slowly moving. There we go. You're fucking dead. Oh, fucking machine gun guy. 
shit. One. Oh yeah, he's freaking invulnerable apparently. God, these freaking bullet freaking hitboxes or whatever on this are freaking really screwing me over right now. Uh, this is not even fair. This is legit not fair, guys. Okay. That is annoying. <laughs> That is so annoying. All right, let's do this shit ahead of time. There's entirely too many enemies. I don't have ammo. Um, like, yeah, I'm gonna have to craft stuff. But yeah, this is not great. Should not be proud of this part of the game. Whoever designed this particular part. Part of the game kind of sucks. I don't remember having an issue with this part. I remember going through this like relatively fine, but it's those fucking stun locks. Okay, maybe if I stick with a harpoon, I'm good. Oh, they're still alive? I thought they were just straight up fucking dead. Okay, let's um let's do that again, I guess. Shit, the wrong thing. Oh, come on. Are you fucking kidding me? That won't blow up if I shoot it with a harpoon. This is so fucking ridiculous. Damn, I, I was not kidding when I said this game is a mixed bag, like there's no fucking tomorrow. Do not stun lock me. You want me to think badly of your game, you're doing a good job of it by having stun locking. Okay, I think we're past it. Thank freaking Christ. All right, we're done with that part. That was annoying as shit. Not cool. If you're gonna have like a shooting gallery like that, you gotta either give this uh, resources for it, because you gave me like 20 shotgun ammo. Uh, that doesn't work when the enemies are far away. By the time you get close to them, they're stun locking you and you're fucking dead and it's... Not good. Let's see. Here. Brain energy. <laughs> A little on the nose. There's a safe room nearby because I hear its song. <laughs> oh, I thought the, uh, the fucking Galeen, I thought it was like their eyes for a second. Here's the uh, safe room, I guess. 
Journal Sebastian Castellanos, July 11th, 2012. Almost six months since the accident. Myra and I drift further apart with every passing week. I have to stay strong, but it's so easy to drown my thoughts in whiskey. I figure as long as it doesn't affect my work, what I do on my own time is private. I finally got Myra to open up to me about the accident. Now I'm more worried than ever. I don't know what's worse, the fact that Myra is becoming paranoid and may be losing her mind, or the fact that what she's proposing, that the fire wasn't an accident, could be real. I owe it to her to trust her instincts, but if they're correct, God help whoever did this. So definitely leaning a bit more into uh, Evil Thin 2 stuff. This stuff doesn't really get uh, resolved in the first game, that's for damn sure. It's more for like flavor background that you don't even really need. Like it, it doesn't. Losing it. It adds to Sebastian's character and background, but it has nothing to do with the A plot. It doesn't really intertwine in like some big fashion or anything like that. A while since your last visit. Yes, it has. All right. Damn, that last part was... Oh, yeah, I don't even have any green gel. Uh, so... Fuck me on that, I guess. Um... Yeah, I don't even bother buying anything, I guess. No keys. So we just need to go out and save and go kill some more dudes. All right. Oh, sniper ammo as one keeps in their office desk, apparently. That sounds Kidman. like Kidman. Ah, oh, that was a step ahead of you, Sebastian. Got a match. Is this open anywhere? Yes. That is a big jar of jelly. That's also a vacuum cleaner over there, apparently. Strong. That no, over here. Around here. Whoops. Gotta go around. <laughs> yeah, there, there's just a lot of fucking baffling design de design decisions in here that I just don't fundamentally agree with. That cause that cause active frustration. Insta deaths, the checkpoints, the stun locks, it's That's what we're gonna name this this episode when I put it up on uh or I name this stream whenever I put it up on YouTube. Uh freaking I'm just trying to get out of there. Oh. That is a bad thing over there. Can I just kill you? Nope. That doesn't do shit. But I have to go through there, apparently. Alright. Go! Yeet! Yeah, that's what I'm gonna name this episode when I put it up on YouTube, just like... Hey, guess what? Uh, stun locking sucks. Don't put it in your game. Oh shit. That thing was very close to getting me. But it did not. Alright, so we gotta go over here. Nope. <laughs> oh, that was close. 
Too many of them. They can't even. I don't know. I guess she's like kind of holding the door back. Um, it's pistol ammo there. Okay. In order to get past, I need to create a diversion, which means um, shooting th that poor guy over here. Oh no, let's shoot that one first. There we go. Alright, then let's go for this. Oh, you motherfucker. That's a good scare. That is a good scare. I will give him that. Freaking dickheaded one, but... That's a real fucking dickhead move. Okay. So I gotta time this. Once that thing starts to raise... On. Come on. There we go. Come on, don't close before I get there. There we go. Time that just right. God, like, there's some beautiful fucking design things there where it just like fakes you out with stuff. And then it just has bad game design. It has great game design, but also horrible. Okay. Do I have any explosives? No. I do have some flashes. Let's use those. Let's see if I can sneak kill some of them. Oh shit. Okay, shit. There we go. Oh, you're not stunned. There we go. Alright, let's go back to using our regular weapons. Which. Oh shit. Reload. Oh shit. Below, dude. One. Fuck that up. Come on. One and two. All right, Kidman's out here, right? There's a whole bunch of them, apparently. Why am I running over here? One. You're not dead. I know it. You know it. No one's good. Okay, now you give me ammo. Freaking machine gun enemies. One, two. <laughs> nice fucking death pose, my dude. Down here. Right now, there's probably gel or something in here. Right. Oh, that's you. Even better. I'm 
so glad you're all right. Ever since the church, I... You were at the church? Yeah, Joseph and I. He's in bad shape, or at least he was when I last saw him. What about the boy from the hospital? Leslie? I found him in a cage. He freaked and ran, though. You know what? Give me one moment, because I want to make sure we type that down. Evil within some incredible eyes with experts game design decisions that purposefully set your expectations before subverting them. It's a damn shame that it also some bafflingly odd uh, I'll use a cinnamon later. God awful design decisions such as to deaths or checkpoints. And stun locking. All right, and we will tweet that out later. There's a sneak peek for everyone in stream. First time that's gonna go out later. Let's see if there's any ammo before we go through there. Green gel. Pistol's a freaking headshot machine now. And you get our damage up on all our other weapons. I think we've all been seeing strange things. Have you been having any nosebleeds, headaches? No. Why? Joseph was. It's like he was turning into one of those things. Maybe it doesn't affect everybody. <laughs> Nothing. Punch the mannequins. All of them. No mercy. Another mannequin arm. Or Jill. Should be able to afford something nice the next time we were able to use a safe room. Now Sebastian's turning. Sebastian? What is this? Stay back. Oh no, did we get shot? No, but apparently we got knocked out. Very similar to uh, Leon in uh, Resident Evil 4, momentarily turning before Ada kind of gets him to chill the fuck out what with a uh, kick to the chest. Did you shoot me? I think she stabbed you him, then kicked him. You a monster. You attacked me. I'm sorry, but you're tainted now. You might try to stop me through you. Wait, what are you talking about? He knows more than she's letting on. But she is playing it smart. Can't blame her for that decision in the slightest. So for now, we just gotta go along with it. Shit! Get it open. Get it open. Get it open. Leslie? Leslie, is that you? It's our favorite dude, Leslie. Albino looking Leslie. Leslie! That's good. Just a little more. Poor Leslie just like, going through all this shit. This is... I feel so bad for this dude. There we go. 
Freaking like Jimenez is dead, which is a good thing because, you know, if you're paying attention to the story or whatnot, Jimenez is kind of a piece of shit, so... No exact amount of sorrow to him for uh, getting off in here. There's a lot of mannequins, though. Danger flammable. Do not shoot your gun in here, because you will die. So this, we got to do this all stealth. And if you get seen, uh, don't shoot. Right, where is this thing? I think it's a little bit up ahead. Nope. Okay. Wait for it to pass. Oh, no. Oh, shit. No, you do not see me. You don't see me. It totally fucking sees me. No, yeah, no, it knows where I am. Yeet. <laughs> Sucks for you, asshole. Don't tell me it can get up here. No, but it's gonna follow me. Alright. For some reason, I always imagine this part's actually in The Evil Within 2. I don't know what part of it is in my brain. I just makes that connection, but... Yeah, no. Part of Evil Within 1. Is there a key somewhere? Shit. Okay. Stealth kill some people if we can. I wonder if we can use the harpoon. Is the harpoon permitted or will that set off the fucking gas too? I don't feel like testing it out either way. Nope. Someone. Around. Oh shit. Oh, there's people in here, but here's the key card. Oh, you know what? Burn them. Oh! Oh, I forgot. You can't light things on fire. Oh, I thought I was being so smart. I'm just like, oh, here's this golden opportunity where I can freaking, um... Here's this golden opportunity. I can take out these two enemies and then dip. And then, uh, yeah, I am very proficient at blowing myself the fuck up, apparently. That's what I'm good at. Grab it. Clap, clap, yeah. I'm, I'm good at clapping myself in that, in that regard. I am, I am, I would like to think I'm good at stealth. In stealth games, or even stealth segments and non stealth games, but I am very good at getting myself blown the fuck up. And god damn, he sees me again. Go around, and then yeet. Shit. Get up, get up, get up. It's a lot of mannequins. Alright, so. Key difference this time. Don't blow myself up. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. <laughs> okay, I guess we're just sprinting. Don't light a fire this time. Okay, out of run juice. Gotta. Oh. Go, 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 go. Get up faster. Oh, they didn't even really chase me over here. They're just chilling. Taking their sweet time, which works for me. Joseph. I'm really tempted to like throw a grenade in there and see what happens, but I don't want to do that section again. Let's see. 
two bullets. Got plenty of shotgun. And sniper. So stick with a shotgun for now. We do have a decent amount of saved up uh, gel, so we should be able to get something nice. Journal Sebastian Cassianos, August 2012. As if I don't have enough to deal with personally and professionally, Joseph, Joseph and I have just been assigned a rookie to train. Great. Babysitting duty. Kidman is young and green, but has that sense of entitlement that all the rookies have these days. I always catch her giving me sideways glances whenever I have to bend the rule book a bit. She doesn't understand that sometimes it's part of the job if you want to break a case. Personality-wise, she's a cold fish distant. It's her job to observe and assist, but sometimes it feels like she's a scientist looking at samples in a petri dish. More like she's merely watching us instead of trying to learn from us. There's something about her that gets under my skin, but I can't quite put my finger on it. As usual, jo I'm sorry, uh, Joseph, as usual, tells me that I'm being oversensitive. I think he's got a crush on her. Maybe. All I know is that I've got to keep things close to the vest when she's around. So... Uh, suspicious of his, uh, of his rookie. A little smarter than she's letting on. Maybe got some, ult some ulterior motives. That probably doesn't approve of him drinking on the job and whatnot. Uh, I did get a key in the meantime. Let's go see what we can get. Yeah, Kidman... You don't find out all of her stuff in this game. They definitely go into like super explicit detail about it in uh, Evil Within 2. Oh, I have too much sniper ammo. Let's reload that. And um, this is actually going to be my first time playing the DLC for the first game. Because uh, for the Game Pass version, it's all packaged in. So I might as well stream that uh, for the first time live. Um, but yeah, apparently you play as Kidman and you kind of see stuff from her perspective, so that will be a learning experience for me as well. Let's see. We don't have an incredible amount to spend. Nothing that I really want. But we should upgrade to the Magnum because we're not going to get many chances to use this because the ammunition's like super crazy limited. I'm not, I, I have not even fired a single bullet out of it yet it's just because I'm trying to conserve it. If it's one thing, uh, well, Kate, Casey's in, in on the stream right now and chats. Um, my strategy for Resident Evil games. Save them all your magnum ammo towards the very end of the game. Bring out all your ammo for the final boss, and you'll just freaking dominate them like it, there's no tomorrow. It's like super cheesing it in a way, but it's damn gratifying. Um, can't really pull that stuff off too much in here because you can't save extra ammunition past like what you can store in your pockets. Um, so yeah, no, no luck on that front. <laughs> For using that strategy here. Where's that spit me out over here? Oh, never mind. Don't want to jump in the water. That's how we did Resident Evil 5, yeah. <laughs> made Wesker freaking, uh. Made that boss battle a lot easier. Even though we did die a lot on that, uh, stupid quick time event trying to get, um,. Trying to get Sheva to climb up out of the volcano and such. She uh, plummeted many, many times. Oh, shit. Wasn't even like a quick time event. Just like, oh, you have to hurry up and press this button uh, when it pops up. It's like, no, it's just fucking button mashing. And I admittedly had never played Sheva in Resident Evil 5, like through the full campaign. So it was not just Casey. Uh... Uh, allegedly being bad at button mashing. AC's very good at button mashing. That part is just so freaking hard. <laughs> yeah, that, that pull up was insane. I, I haven't worked out in a hot minute. I, I can do some sit ups. I can do some push ups. I can, I can run for a while, but 
Yeah, that pull up. One. Pull up's hard to do. You can do a, you can do 10, 20, 50 of those. Good on you. You're in shape. Um, being able to do it in a volcano is another thing. And people deserve accolades for being able to do that. Yeah, surprisingly, it was infinitely easier to punch a fucking boulder as Chris than to just do a simple pull up. I don't even know what the fuck was going through his brain. Just like, there's a boulder in the way. Can I like maybe like jump across it or anything? No, his, his instinct, not even to like initially push it, is to punch it as if that's going to fucking do anything. And it, I mean, it works. I can't argue with the results. At least I haven't had any more episodes. I wish I could say the same. Hey, I think I might have found us some transportation. You found a car in the city filled with cars? Good job, buddy. This thing gonna run? Only one way to find out. Shit! Oops. What are you doing? Answer me. That is a nasty insect looking egg. Leg. Egg leg. I forgot about this thing. Oh shit. Let's, yeah, let's freaking shoot this thing, apparently. Shit. I'm only using the sniper rifle because there's extra ammo here. Otherwise, I'd be using the shotgun. Oh, that is dropping maggots or something. Oh, damn it. Okay, I should have shot those. There we go. Oh, there's hell I am already. Right hell yeah. Hell a pistol ammo. Yeah, this is pretty gross. This is 10 out of 10 nasty right here. How does he know where to turn? I'm not even looking that direction. Oh shit. I don't know how long we'll be safe here. Uh, we can't really move forward. You know what? I gotta use a bathroom real quick though. I will be right back. Right, and we are back. Fight more. Oh, now 
<laughs> it literally tossed me more ammo. What the fuck? Probably shouldn't be doing that. Freaking zombie haunted possessed dudes. Why are my headshots not landing? Freaking hit detection is all kinds of wonky. Hey, buddy. Is that it? You're gonna toss me more ammo to kill you with? Enemy to the right. Ah, shit. Um, let's do this. No, do not use that. Why are these not hitting? Or do they have to like cross a certain threshold or something? Get the cover. They're shooting from above. Damn it. At least freaking Joseph's helping me out here. This is a Okay, yeah. Freaking headshots. Not working. Let's not bother. You guys wanna push those uh boxes though down though. I won't uh I won't stop you. And it's just a shooting gallery. Oh, shit. There we go. Oh, damn it. Oh, that did a lot of fucking damage. I did way too much. Oh, there we go. I am shooting the barrel. Why is it? God, like, even with the barrels, it's like this big old freaking red object, and it's just not going. <laughs> Shit. Reload. Like, if I just suck at aiming, I'm willing to accept that, but my red kills like right on the big obvious barrel I would expect the uh, the shot to land this is going on for a while actually Leave these ones to me there you go oh right up front okay That is convenient. That was a close one. Um, let's get this going. Oh, got some more pistol ammo. Not much else, though. Is our spider friend going to come back? Keep us to the left up here. Yep, there's our spider friend. One, two. Oh shit. Do not stab me. I would not enjoy that. Oh, that looks like a maggot's gonna fall right out of there. That's so gross. Oh shit. How am I supposed to dodge that? Like, legitimately, how am I supposed to dodge that? No, do not spawn maggots. What the fuck? Go it on. Damn it. Do not spawn. Shit. Okay. Um At least it's spawning me resources, I'll take it. 
There we go. Get this thing moving. Don't have jack shit for ammo. Uh, I literally have two bullets to my name. Well, I guess I have the hand cannon. But let's. Oh, I have gren a grenade. Um. And then. Uh, what else do I want? I can just pausing time to craft all these things freaking on our ass. as if by someone's will. So it's nearly impossible to get any sense of the geography around here. But the light, Beacon Mental Hospital, it's always in the distance. This thing you found me hooked up to, I've seen it in more than one place. Yeah, so have I. It seems like it's the same exact one, but it's hard to be sure. The thing that I've noticed is that each time I run across one, I seem to be closer to the lighthouse. It could be a coincidence, but like I said, it seems as if there is some intelligence behind it. So you figure we ought to cut to the chase and just head straight for the hospital? Exactly. Nice work, detective. I mean, the entire Outside, game's in, like, funneling to you hospital. towards it. It's... It, this is not a big brain move by... Oh! That's what you get for your no. fucking supposed big brain energy, Joseph. Just get us out of here! That was a There's hell of a shot, there. though. There might be some kind of first aid. I mean, I have first aid. I have plenty of needles we can use. I guess we need some kind of arbitrary first aid MacGuffin for a boy Joseph. So, that's what we're doing. And if I recall correctly, uh, enemies are just going to keep spawning in this zone. So, we got to like, hardcore push. That is... I disagree with being shot right there. Oh, shit. Damn it. No, don't shoot me. Shit. Okay. I need to heal. You know what? If I can hit that. Like, yeah, uh, it's not gonna happen. Where are you going, dude? if I just hit you with this. <laughs> oh shit. Oh no 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 no. Alright, we are completely screwed on ammo. Let's craft some more bolts, I guess. Alright. Let's, uh, try to be sneaky here. I should probably upgrade my, like, regular harpoon bolts. Sneaky. Okay, you saw me. Oh, there's a explosive. Okay, he didn't see me though. Where's that bomb at? It's somewhere around here because I stood up and it was freaking out for a second. Where's that bottle? I can toss it over there. Pistol ammo, that's good. There we go. Oh, no. Oh, what the fuck? 
No, 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 no. <laughs> Blew up your freaking partner. Nice. Works for me. Okay, that sniper is gonna be an issue. Damn it. This is going awful. My plan sucks. Oh, where'd that sniper go? I didn't kill him. I didn't even come close to killing him. I like knocked off like part of his uh, mass. That was it. Probably coming down for revenge personally. Okay, there is the bomb. It's behind me. Shit. Damn it. Fuck. Okay, really didn't need that to happen right now. Let's get my health recovered. Gotta stand still for that. Don't know where that sniper went. Alright, so that's gonna be recovered. Heal. Oh, what the fuck? Why would I want to hide right now? Like, I guess, like, yeah, some of this is, like, part stealth, but... Not gonna be doing that. There you are. Anything else around here I could use? Oh, something... There we go. Can I climb over here? Okay, where am I supposed to? Oh, okay, just literally go around. Hemostatic. Hemostatic? An emergency blood client agent for treating wounds. The bandage contains medication for easy to use first aid. Or, you know, just stick with the needles I've been using this entire place. There's literally one right there. Map fragments. Alright, so now we gotta go in reverse. And now they have a fucking turret, apparently. Because survival horror? I can't even see the... Wait, no? I can get it. There we go! Hell yeah. Okay, all we have is shotgun ammo. Right here. Let's do this. Blind him, and then we can spin this around. Shit. This is very cathartic. This is extremely cathartic. More coming from the right. Barely see what I'm shooting at, but if it works, it works. Oh, there's so many of them coming. Oh shit. Oh shit. Okay, are we good? Go. It would have been nice if all these things would have dropped uh, resources, but. Oh shit. One, two, let's toss one more. One, two, uh, oh wait, toss that. 
shit. Oh shit, motherfucker dodged me, holy shit. Oh, damn it. You're trying to just straight up fucking kick me, dude? Alright, let's just run back to the fucking turret. Because, fuck it. Apparently you're stuck up there. <laughs> they went flying! Oh, their textures got all fucked up. I got no idea where that enemy, other enemy flew off to. Quit crying, Joseph. You'll be fine. I've gone so much worse than you. Shit. Let's get out of here fast. I'm gonna push through. It's gonna get a lower up. Oh, you see that after we already start running zombies over? You could you could dodge some of these. Oh, I'm driving. I thought this was a cutscene. <laughs> it's like, damn, you're you're a really shit driver, Kidman. Uh, meanwhile, it was I who was the shit driver. go. That was a pretty action-packed chapter. Um, yeah, pretty good all around. No, if, if this chapter had the stupid gondola segment, then fuck this chapter, because that ruined my entire experience with that chapter, but if that's not the same chapter as that, then solid A chapter. Maybe, maybe B, a little bit too action, two bit, two bit set PC maybe, but solid. Oh no, not the magical school bus. Forget how many chapters in this. This game is surprisingly freaking long. It's not like a six hour, it's not an eight hour. It's like, I want to say like 12, 15, maybe even like near 20, like on your first playthrough because you don't really know what you're doing. It's not like it's a big open world or anything. It's just. Hard, and if you know what stuff to upgrade, you're gonna have a significantly easier time. Is that a box I could break? Yes, it is. Oh, we have ammo for that. Do you like ammo? Where the fuck did Joseph go? Is he over here? Yeah, there he is. <laughs> we won't know unless we get down there. Yep, bus is all the way down there. Journal Sebastian Castellanos, September 1st, 2012. Myra is gone. I haven't heard from her in days. Went to report it, but they think I'm crazy. Car, her computer, some of her belongings are gone. There's no sign of foul play. Everyone thinks that she left me. 
They keep talking about my drinking, as if it had something to do with Myra's disappearance. Except that they're not treating it as a disappearance. They look at me like I'm to blame for her leaving, but I know she didn't leave. Someone took her. She was getting too close to something, but what? So it's either um, Sebastian being paranoid, or he's onto something, but this game doesn't really get into it. Uh, this is all set up for the sequel. Push him. <laughs> Let me see if I can. Nope. Can't do it. I'm sorry to disappoint. Let's go back to the mirror. And let's get... Oh, this place is getting really fucked up as the game goes on. Do I have any keys? No. I don't even... I barely have any gel. There's no real reason for me to upgrade. Uh, let's just go ahead and save again and then dip. Right. Alright, and back to it. It's not worth even looking to upgrade because we can't afford anything. I didn't get my stimmy in between chapters. It would appear so. Can I disable these? Or do you have to do it right here? Otherwise, we will burn and most likely die. I don't want to do that. Now, I remember this segment particularly well, whenever I think about this game, because it has some good, um, running from totally not Pyramid Head Jeez. boss. What could cause this much damage? An earthquake? The thing we saw in, like, the first the 30 minutes of the game? Yeah, but look how it's positioned. If we can get over there, we might be able to use it to get across. That is a horrible Let's idea. Concentrate on getting out of here. That is such a god-awful idea. But we're gonna do it anyway. Ah, oh, this is a stupid idea. Oh! Shit, get off, get off, get off, dude! Separated from our boy. It's all COVID's fault. We can't hang out with the boys. Damn it. First Kidman, now. Oh, we got a sniper shot. Round, whatever. Yep. There's our boy, the keeper. <laughs> Oh, that's fucking brutal. I love it. It's so fucked up. Let's see. Matches were full on. Don't step on those. Can I disarm? No? Yes, you can. And use these to craft stuff to stun uh big boss. Who apparently walked through the fire. Should probably just fucking die in there for all I care. Missile ammo. What, are you just trapping regular enemies too? Or what's, what's his MO? Turn around? Because you have a gun. There we go. Oh, son of a bitch. Got traps. Let me get you. 
I am so close. There we go. Oh. I did not mean to hide from this enemy, but... I guess it works. Let me see if I can... Uh, sneak kill him. Is I... Oh wait, we can look to the left. Here, let's let's fucking get this dude. Let's punk him. Right. He did not see me? Oh! Yeah, he does. Shit. Oh shit. Run, 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 run. Give it. The fuck? What the fuck was all that about? Shit. Get his legs down. And burn. Yeah, for enemies you can't get headshots, uh, shooting them in the legs is a pretty damn good strategy. So you can at least burn them. Uh, matches aren't a thing in the second game, if I recall. Um... But that strategy doesn't really work in the second game, I guess. Shit. Twist his dick off. Yeah, that, that's the best way to, to freaking off these dudes. They, they lose their power once you do that. Now I think about it, I don't think there's many, um... There's many, uh, possessed women in this game? I know there's a bunch in two. I know for a fact there's a bunch in two, because there's, like, a specific, uh, enemy in, uh, two that that's, has, like, the same woman character model, and it's fucking scary as shit. It can kill you real easy. Oh, fuck, I didn't mean to shoot. Oh, fuck. Damn it. Oh wait, we stunned him. And uh, you know, no, I root damn it. Oh, oh no. Oh no 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 no. Everything's going. That went fucking awful. That went so bad. So fucking quick. It's always fucking bombs. It is always explosives that fuck me over. God, it's always explosives. This game is a fucking dickhead sometimes. <laughs> By sometimes I mean more often than fucking not. Whoops. Hey. Just, just walk this way. Keep walking. There we go. How are you not dead from that? Alright. That sucked. I want to see if I can stealth kill this guy. Just don't look this way. Look the other way. The other way's cool. This way's lame. You don't want to look this way. There we go. There we go. Yep, and he gives us a whole bunch of green jelly. What more could you want? I don't think I even grabbed that gel last time. Don't turn around. Do not turn around. There we go.
Oh shit, someone saw me. Are they gonna be coming though? They like actively know where I am? Oh, dude. Dude's across. God damn it. Shit. I'm trying to blow you up, dude. Not blow up. Frickin' set on fire. Lime flavored? Yeah, that's what the green gel is. It's the best flavor you can get. Uh, let's heal up. Damn, I only have one. Shit. It's starting to get fucked up. Okay, so they can pass through the acid just fine. Um, where's that other Ruvik clone at? Oh, that's him right there. Shit. Oh, he didn't see me. What an idiot. Need you to turn around. I'll sneak up behind you. There. Oh, I was about to say, don't do a freaking 180 on me. Oh, damn it! Come on, get down on your knees. There we go. Shit. Don't fucking kick me. I'll kick you. Get some more of that. Oh, shit. Go. Got some John Wick shit going on here. <laughs> Get some more of that lime flavored fucking goop. Do not shoot me. Do I not have matches? Oh, I have matches, just didn't go through. Oh, I missed some green goop. Yeah, this is one giant freaking checkpoint nightmare. Like, if I if I fuck up at any point in this, I'm gonna have to do this entire section all over again. All right, so at least we can make a straight beeline back from there. Um, there's another. Nope. Damn it. I don't have any more health, so I freaking hit scan bullet enemies or. Not doing me wonders right now. Uh, let's explore over here, I guess. Oh, no! <laughs> I am not even going to try to disarm that, because if I fuck up, I'm dead. And I don't want to do this all over again. So I'm just going to leave that one the fuck alone. Actually, you know what? Better safe than sorry. Fuck, I can't even shoot it from my ear. Okay. Retracting that plan. Okay, let's just walk past it. Don't shoot it. Don't try to disarm it. Oh. There's one right there, too. That's a dickhead move. Real dickhead move. I would go for it if I had extra ammo, but I don't. Not ammo, extra health. Okay. Um. okay we gotta go through here. Oops, come on, pick that up. Goop. More brain goop. Lime flavored brain goop. Disarm. I guess technically you can try to stall through this whole thing and just disarm this and then dip, but I don't know. Seems like entirely too many enemies to try that. 
or goop. Can I smash these? Nope. I wonder what that glowing red sign means. Does that mean that it gives me health? I wonder what it could possibly do for me. Can I disarm it though? Yes. Alright, what other ammo do I have? Shotgun, two shots, harpoon, and that. So basically, jack shit. Oh. Freaking. We're gonna have to fight the keeper. Oh shit. Oh, that's not good. Let's grab some stuff. Run! Oh shit, that is a bat- that is a tripwire. Shit. Damn it, where are you? There we go. Let's get that fucking brain goop. And you're respawning immediately. That is not cool. That is not cool. Uh, oh, I have grenades. Let's use these. Oh, shit. Fuck. God damn it. Okay. Ah, uh, shit. This is not cool. And you know what? It might be time for the Magnum, as much as I don't want to use it. It's time for the Magnum. Shit! Oh, <laughs> he almost got me. You gonna give me brain goop? Can he stop spawning, though? Shit. Come on. One. Two. I do not want to have to use a Magnum, but... Where is he? Oh! What? I did not expect him to be over there. At least we're farming him for goop. That's something we can do. Yep. Man, wasted a lot of ammo there. Not very happy about that. Let's, um... Let's make some harpoons. And... Really need health though. Kidman, are you in there? Nope. Green goop. Got a lot of that now, at least, so that's good. Hey, dead body. At least we have a freaking... Still no idea who the fuck this is supposed to be. Haven't you figured it out yet? Oh, he loves tormenting others. Has to let them know he has the upper hand. Lays out the bait. Gets his victim all worked up. His unholy traps. When it was happening to me, I could see what was going on. I could see it, but I couldn't turn back. I had to know. I had to know the truth, and he knew it. Detective Castellanos. Lady, 
Level with me. Am I going crazy? If one wishes to survive, one would do well to consider who they trust. Hmm, what could that possibly mean? Maybe something to do with some distrust uh, going on between our comrades, especially one who was specifically noted in the previous note to the save room? Couldn't possibly be who she's referring to. All right. So we are having a syringe problem. <laughs> Uh, we need to get the most out of our syringes, so let's upgrade health we get from it. Um, can we upgrade anything else that we care about? I don't believe so. Let's upgrade our harpoon, because we're going to have to be relying on that for a quick minute. And that's it for now. Alright, um, half of mine to end the stream now because I am going to be playing, um, I am going to be doing some of the new Among Us stuff with some friends on another server. Oops, that's the wrong channel. Games. Yep, one where? Alright, um... I don't know, because if we don't wind up doing Among Us, I might as well just keep doing this, because I'm having a good time. I don't really have anything... Well, I have some stuff I should be playing, like, to get through my backlog. I've kind of told myself, like, hey, let's play through World of Warcraft. We're in, like, I'm, like, in the post, um campaign I guess but you can't really advance it without doing daily stuff and I've already done all the daily stuff for today so uh that is what it is got more brain goop though oh this door opened uh it has a hole I don't really want to go down quite yet actually because because like, we're supposed to be playing at like 8:30, uh, I might might not stream it. Um, yeah, I'll just keep playing for now. It's fine. Really need some health because <laughs> it sucks when you when you get to so there's like the bottom threshold you can really get for like regenerating health, uh, but when it's regenerating, you can't sprint when you're at this threshold. So if you get hit once and there's a fast enemy, you're just screwed. Oh, there we go. And we are back in a semi-decent place, but with no backup health. That person has some fucking bombs on him. That took forever to dismantle. What do I even have? Two or three shotguns, bells, sniper. I don't want to get close. <laughs> oh, they blew up so bad. Oh, oh, that is fucked up. Where the fuck did that even come from? <laughs> what the shit? Oh! <sighs> Forgot that one's just... Okay, all that health we just got, just... Down the fucking drain, I guess. <laughs> oh, that sucks so bad. I got screwed twice. Game is fucking devious. Be very, very careful in here.
Is this where I'm supposed to be going? I'm getting a lot of resources at the very least. God, that freaking that got me good. But I need to stand here so I can regenerate health real quick. Uh, that fucked me up good. Where did they even come from? I I, I guess that door over there, but it's... got hit by a sneaky enemy. Got hit by a bomb. Fuck my life. Oh, finally got a Cairo bolt. I haven't had one of those in forever. Damn, I just gained supplies like crazy. Is a, is a game trying to make it up to me now? Is it trying to be nice? Is it just getting ready to screw me over again? I'm gonna, I'm gonna say the latter. It's getting ready to screw me. It's promising me the world. I don't trust anything in this fucking room. There's Joseph. Oh shit. And it's Rubik. Here to completely fuck up my day, I guess. Oh god, now what? If I remember correctly, there's going to be some kind of giant blade or something coming across. Uh, oh, I do have a syringe. Nice. I could sure as fuck use that. Oh. Oh no, I thought that was a wire. Oh, fuck me. Okay. Okay, we need to get through here. Oh, no! Do not... Okay, I can't do anything against those. Okay, I need to find a safe way through. None of these ways are safe. The situation is just fucked. Oh, shit, 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 shit. There's a lot of wires around here. Here, let's deactivate this. Don't even, can't even go this way, but. Oh shit. Oh shit. Shit. There's so many. Can I jump over? Please. Oh shit. Oh shit. <laughs> I'm I am tripping so many of these things. Oh, this is bad. Shit, shit. Oh. Okay, they slice you and they fucking explode. This is fucked up. Okay, do not hit me. Please. As if being sliced having your fucking feet cut off isn't bad enough, it's gonna explode too. Let's try over here first. Brain juice, ammo. I need health so bad. I'm just fucking starved for it. <laughs>
that something sees me. Now oh, the keeper's chasing him. Shit. Okay. You again? I got more ammo this time, asshole. Can we just? Yep. We have to fight. Oh shit. Oh, there's ammo right there too. Reload. Shit, there's stuff right there. There we go. Oh, and now he's got freaking traps going. Yeah, that's not cool, buddy. Oh, god damn it. It was either that or get blown up. There we go. Oh, do not hit me. Do not. Go, 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 go. Telling me. <laughs> Fuck. I read. Am I just stuck? I hear sounds. I can't activate my lantern. It's just all dark. Statue. Get the key. Punch that. Nothing in it. I'd better find Kidman. Yes, we should. Decent amount of stuff um, to buy stuff with. There's some really damn good parts of this game. There's a lot of really She's bad right. parts. What's she after? He's got Leslie. I'm so paranoid about freaking sprinting because I know there's going to be like traps or something I'm going to accidentally hit and blow up and I don't want to blow up. I've been blown up one too many times. Fifty too many times. Bubbles apparently. Very important to Ruvik to have bubbles in his fucking nightmare world. Can take the train all the way home? No, Leslie. Not today. You'll protect me. This is the most coherent yes. he's been. That's my job. Why is this, why does she have freaking purple eyes? They'll be it's pretty anime. There's some fucking of mice and men shit, freaking gunning Lenny down. You don't understand. You don't know what he'll become. I do. I've seen it. You don't understand what Rubik is after. So tell me, what is he after? He's after Leslie. What, he needs to finish his science project? Don't patronize me. I have orders. 
I can't let him have this boy. Kidman's a fucking assassin of me. Oh shit. She fucking shot Joseph, dude. Yeah, man, she wanted to tend to wabbits. <laughs> oh, I fucking love that book. A sad fucking ending. Yeah, uh, our very easily confirmed suspicions were indeed correct. Um, she's trying. To, she she's uh got ulterior motives. She's trying to kill our boy Leslie. She fucking shot our boy Joseph. These, these are facts. I know I was giving Joseph a hard time for being a little punk ass, but I don't know if I'd straight up shoot my boy. Joseph, I don't approve. You've got to be alive. <laughs> the chapter names literally ulterior motives. Like no shit. Anything to get? Nope. Well, I guess we're at the subway, um, with that god-awful plan to frickin' use the, uh, subway between the two, like, little separated continents, is it the word? The, the land masses split. There's goop. Oh, uh, shotgun ammo. More shotgun ammo. Game's actually being very nice to me right now, and I appreciate that. Wouldn't it be very survival horror. Oh! oh! Wouldn't it be very survival horror if uh, I had like a Call of Duty amounts of fucking uh, ammo on me? Crafting. Matches, grenades. I am missing so many of these map fragments. It doesn't even matter at this point. Um, one grenade. Nope. Oh, boxes. Let's uh, go back to the safe room. It says that there's an enemy around here. Note from Myra, my dear Sebastian. If you've received this letter, then I fear the worst has come to pass. It means that my investigation got too close to the truth. It means that you may never see me again. I'm sorry I kept it from you, but it was to protect you from either the truth or my madness. I have enclosed a copy of my files. I only hope that you never receive them, but if you do, it's up to you to finish what I started. Please find justice for Lily and for me. I love you with all my heart, Dash Myra. Yeah, nothing. It's, it's not really spoiler to say nothing manifests from this um, in this game, which is which would be really weird if uh, a sequel was never made. It's just Don't you think you should use your green gel? that's exactly why I came here. You don't gotta remind me. <laughs> I assume that a lot of this is based on, um, based on like the amount of resources and stuff you have. It'll spawn you in different locations around here. But, uh, yeah, good, good suggestion all around. Oh, 5,000. That's a decent amount of green gel. Bandit, why are you just passed out on the ground? Alright, so maybe let's not invest too much in the Magnum, because I have not even found a single um, 
box of ammo for it. Life gauge, syringe recovery. We are having syringe issues, that's for sure. But we do need to be able to do more damage, that's also true. Let's get my pistol damage up. Won't need a heal for doing too much damage. Alright. I could have sworn I've been playing this for longer. We only have about nine hours of gameplay time. Feels, feels a lot longer. Granted, I've only been playing this on stream. Yeah, I would say this is probably 12 hours or so. Decently, uh, dec decently, yeah, what's, decently length? That's not the fucking word. It's a decently long game. Let's put it that way. Oh, shit. That is a lot of explosives. I see now why it gave me a bottle. There we go. Oh, shit. Come on. Let's shoot that. Your face is fucking missing and you're still going at it. Can I just arm? Yes. Okay, these things are so much faster to explode than uh, the regular stuff, so I gotta... Be really careful. Shit. Okay, it doesn't work when there's multiple. I, I can do one before it blows up, but... Not... Like, two of them. Okay. Come on, come on. There we go. At least they don't do as much damage as, like, the regular wall ones. Otherwise, I probably would have been dead. I open these. Nope. Oh shit. My pistol's too godly, and that's the way I like it. Oh shit. Um. Damn it. I don't like that. Alright, we gotta knock this dude down. There we go. That is someone pinned up against the wall. Oh shit. <laughs> oh shit. Don't blow it. Oh man, I don't want to... I don't want to fuck with that because I don't have extra health. Or no, yes I do. Never mind. Please don't fuck this up, Jose. There we go. Oh shit, there's another Rubik clone. Probably try to get them out of the way as soon as I can. Oh, we got a lot of sniper ammo right here. Let's do this. Get a lot of these guys out of the way as soon as we can. We gotta be quick about this. Oh 
There we go. Here, shit. Get him, get him, get him, get him. Shit. Get up here, buddy. How am I missing these shots? There we go. I haven't had like an axe or a torch in freaking forever. I don't know what's up with that. Alright. Oh shit. Oh shit. Fucking has a gun. Brain gel, apparently. Shotgun ammo. Should really get out of the water. I'm super freaking vulnerable in here. Shit. Disarm. The oh, I could probably disarm the other one too for parts. Did it even give me parts? No. Oh. Did that not? Really? I need to be closer. Let's just snipe because that dude's got a sniper. That. Oh shit. Oh shit, he's not dead. Burn. Just babysit him for a second. That's my bomb. But it won't blow me up immediately. I need a shotgun ammo. Enemy somewhere around here. Oh, wait, I think it's right. Just went past. Where'd he go? Oh, it's in there. There we go. Oh, nice. Okay. Not gonna fuck with these. Disarm one at a time. I think I basically just gained those as ammo too, so might as well use them. That is still a bad idea. Shit. Nope, do not do that. Don't do that up close. Anything? Nope.
We gotta burn these, I guess. Okay, see, th those bolts go through fences, not the regular harpoons or whatever. Okay. You're getting up. I'm gonna be trying to use these as much as I can while enemies are at a distance because... Um, I do not want to deal with these up close, because I am very good at blowing myself up. Dead, dead? Nope. Only semi dead. Snipers are very good against this enemy. So, just gonna keep doing that. I don't know why I grabbed the bottle. That guy's dead. I don't trust you at all. <laughs> oh, I fucking knew it. The oh, fuck? That is a weird pulsating mass of flesh. I don't like that. <laughs> oh, that's so gross. Journal Sebastian Castellanos, December 20th, 2012. No word from Myra since I received the packet. I'm afraid to take this evidence to my superiors. What Myra is suggesting is horrifying and may reach corridors of power beyond my reach, but the evidence she provided is enough to convince me that Lily's death was not an accident. They finally accepted Myra as a missing persons case, but refused to involve me. They say it's because I'm family, but I think that they consider me a suspect. The investigation is stalled, but for the sake of my family, I will continue the investigation on my own. Alright, it's back to the safe room. Weird little twirl around. Have you forgotten something? No. Wait. No, I have not. Don't fuck with me like that. Um, go save. And I'm probably just going to call the stream now because it is getting close to Among Us time. Um, yeah, I'm going to call the stream. Thanks everyone for hanging out. Follow me on uh, Twitter, Twitch, YouTube, Medium, Podcasts, etc., etc. All the links are down below. All pretty self explanatory. Oh, and Patreon also. Uh, thanks for hanging out. Uh, yeah, see you later, Justin, and I will see you guys next time.